I've owned a bakery, I've owned a restaurant, a hotel, a lounge. Iniedo had a lot to get off her chest, you know. Uh, first and foremost, I love the way that she announced her motherhood and, and surrogacy. You know? And I had to ask her, she did it like a boss, you know, why? Did she have to go the surrogacy route? How, why did she do, do the announcement in that way? I chose the surrogate because, I mean, I, I had a couple of miscarriages, you know, mm -hmm. and I just got tired of trying and I didn't want to try. I don't have a husband, so I'm like, I want a child for myself, whether I have a husband or not. So that, what, what other option could I have? I was, and I wanted it to be my child, yeah. my egg. Yeah. So thankfully, my eggs are good, yeah. so I did that. You know, she tells me the moment when she first was hit by a scandal and she was in traffic at Antony Village and seeing all these magazines with negative stories. I was cruising in my Murano, just trying. I was living in Antony Village then. I was just, you know that junction where they have the, the newspaper stand? Yes, yes, yes. Almost all the magazines that had come out that week had my picture on it, on the front cover, with different captions. And I remember just black, blanking out for a bit. I couldn't go forward, I couldn't come back. Mm. The cars behind me were just honking. I had, like I was in shock. Yeah. So for a few minutes, I didn't know what to do, how to move the car, what to touch. I was, my hands were literally shaking. Mm. 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 I had tears, like my eyes. So I had to just pull out of the road mm. and just, and get that's how bad it was. Yeah. How, you know, pressure from family made her marry and that she regrets it. Did you regret the decision the first time? And would you do it again? To get married? Yeah. Yes, I did. You regretted it? Yeah. Right. Why did you regret it? Because it just wasn't the right move to make. Right, yeah, yeah, yeah. So would you do it again? If the right person comes. So again, you would do it at your own time if it really... At my own time if, if the right person comes. comes. If it doesn't come, I'm good. What all of these things have taught her, but more importantly, how she's learned to be her full self. You know, when you meet a person with full self energy, there is nothing sexier. She is in her own body fully. It's one thing about me, I'm not desperate for nothing. I don't know how to be desperate over anything. I just believe that things will work out fine. Everything will come together. Things are coming together, but I also know that I still don't feel that fulfillment that I have all that I need now. Yeah. And it's such a delight to interview a woman who knows herself and doesn't care what anybody thinks about it. The queen joins me with she. So this is the first time our beautiful actress in Niedo is coming out to talk about her previous marriage that ended in the year 2023. So she talked about it, her regrets, what, you know, what led to her early marriage and, you know, why she ended it and all of that. So she also talked about her beautiful baby girl because everyone knows that she didn't get pregnant, you know, she didn't show the baby bump until she came out with her baby to celebrate her birthday and announced that she welcomed her baby through surrogacy. She also did not want to show her face to the media. That's why you see the baby back in um at the camera okay so she said um she is still open to marriage if the right person comes that she's not under any pressure that she's just herself that if the right person comes then she will give in if she doesn't see any you know good person or good match to herself she will also keep to herself that she will still be good with or without marriage that is so courageous of her like i know a lot of young ladies are out there you know desperate to get married seeing that they are getting old they are aging but our beautiful screen goddess Iniedo doesn't care. She has made it for herself. She doesn't need a man to support her or to make her complete. She also mentioned that she, she has other business she's running. She has a bakery. She has a hotel, a lounge, and, you know, many other business. She also has a skincare um business that she's currently running now and she also have this beauty um, makeup palette and all of that. Like, she 
she runs a lot of business now like i love how classy inedo is she doesn't mess up like the way she carry herself the way she presents herself and that's the way people address her she doesn't make noise she's just on her lane winning for herself and her family and she also talked about her previous marriage that she was pressured by her family to get into the marriage and she regretted it the marriage also lasted for five years and she also talked about you know not being interested in the marriage at first that it was only because of the family that she got married our beautiful Inedo is a strong lady and she believes so much in herself her craft whatever she's doing she believed it with her full chest and she's winning and she's not making noise like other people that we know okay so guys let me know what you guys think about this video Inedo is an inspiration to so many young beautiful ladies out there and yeah let me know what you think about her in the comment section do you think you can also do the same as Inedo going through surrogacy to you know welcome a baby do you think is what you can do if you have the money or if you have been trying to get pregnant and you cannot and you suggest surrogacy do you think you can also go through it as a woman let me know your thoughts in the comment section thank you so much for watching